guys, guess what? I got my expander taken out. <laughs> She's about to turn it. Let's go inside. for me. Together. I think you guys got your turns complete. I don't think we need to do any more turns. see her get her going with that um we'll see her in four weeks to bond some braces on that front we're gonna start moving those teeth but no more turns for jada she did good um so i'm gonna get this set up real quick <laughs> It could. This is this one's kind of nice because it's it's not on the sides. The, some of them fit around the sides. That's usually when they they come out. I expect the first couple of nights this to be weird and come out. It could happen. So I'm just gonna measure. Go ahead and close for me. There we go. Too tall. Hi, 
basically what it uses is your chin and your forehead as an anchor and it helps pull that the upper jaw forward. How do you take it off? It's just that you take the rubber bands off. So that's only the only thing holding it are the rubber bands to this little hook back here right together. One thing too, mom, if, if she's getting a little raw, you know, on her chin from wearing this and she said she rolls around at night and that from that rubbing, um, you could get like um, old t-shirt and kind of cut it up and get it on there. Or what's great is like for lady shoes, they sometimes have those pads, especially like those um, fake animal furs type things, things like that kind of helps. But same thing for like a heel, kind of fits perfectly right in there too. But some people just cut up an old t-shirt and it helps. If, if we start seeing it get a little red, this is from rubbing. It usually means they're wearing it really well when we see that. And then basically all you do is just kind of hold it there and she's got this little hook. You can kind of see that hook there. Mm -hmm. You just got to get the rubber band on that, just like that and we just pull it forward right there. And then you do the other side. Sometimes it's just easier to get these both on first. So you get the little hook close for me a little bit. To get on that hook and then you could go and get it on the other hook and then all you do pull it forward like that that's a baby tissue. So we use those as like sacrificial lambs to kind of help line up the front fork. Um, so I push off of them, pull off of them. It's kind of a little trick you can use to line up the front fork. But those, um, I'm really not so trying to put them under Actually, if I took that rack down, I'd probably come out with it. Yeah. Guys, guess what? I got my expander taken out. Check it, I said I did it. The orthodontist told me that I did a good job turning my expander, so they gave me this face mask to wear, but I cannot wear it outside. I have to wear it inside. So if I go outside and play on the trampoline, I cannot wear it. I have to come back in four weeks, and guess what? Drum roll, please. Wait. <laughs> I get braces, and then in every other one of my videos in four weeks, you're going to see me with braces every time I smile. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and hit that notification bell. Love you guys. Braces are the best.